Safari Windsor responds to rumors that she passed after her page got hacked. Okay. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So, first and foremost, as you can see, I'm alive. I might look a little busted, but my ass is here. Second of all, I want to make sure everybody can hear this, too. Because I saw a couple of comments that said I faked my own. Anybody that knows me knows I would never do some shit like that ever first and foremost okay secondly like i said i don't know who hacked into my phone and why that's what they would want to put on there you know but it happens it happens to everybody it's the first time it ever happened to me i've never been hacked before and I would never have even known until probably much later, I probably would have known. But I wouldn't have even known if my homeboy didn't come to my house and was like, yo, it looked like he saw a ghost when I answered the door. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I would never, there's nothing that can make me want to tell somebody I'm motherfucking d Ain't nothing in this world to make me say some like that. I'm going to show y'all something because I'm glad. Well, first of all, before I even show y'all this, what I am happy about is that people do care. And I truly, from the bottom of my heart, love the fact that people do care and that you guys were really concerned. But all my friends was concerned. Here they go. Say y'all. Yeah. Say hey. Hey, hey, she ain't hey, y'all. I ain't no spirit. And I ain't no spirit. And she don't be playing no games she, like yeah, that. Yeah, whoever hacked her shit, not funny. We gonna Period. find out. She not find out. Ooh, they they all popped up over here. It was like, yo, like, like Breeze, please tell these people what happened. For uh, real. Yo, only thing I'm gonna say is I was at the house. I saw shit on Instagram. And immediately, I said, calling her. I threw my shoes on and I came over here because I live five minutes from her. And when she opened the door, I swear to God, I saw a ghost. <laughs> but you know what? That was the uh, most good. pleasant ghost I've ever seen in my life. So everybody out there, this is real. Safari's so not. Thank you. And it's like you know what though? Hashtag what? Is... Hashtag oh y'all funny. These is hashtag Safari's so not. <laughs> really? These are my friends. But the bottom line is though, or even more serious than that, is because I never knew that many people cared. But it makes me feel good to know that that many people care. It's just the wrong way for me to find out about it. Somebody saying you dead. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I'm glad my mama didn't hear that. She probably would have had a heart attack. But thank God she never on the internet. You know what I'm saying? She probably would have passed out and just not been here with me at all. Because she, she wouldn't have been able to handle something like that. But I want to thank God, first of all, that I am here. Second of all, I want to thank all of y'all that did care, you know, and sent condolences, which was wild. Was like, when I looked at it, that was like straight, like being in your own funeral. I mean, like being in your own funeral, I'm going to rest in peace. It's like, I, that is crazy. That is crazy. And thank God I was able to get back into my phone through my email. And I guess the person, whoever did it, I'm thinking I know who it is. I don't think it was a random person. I think I know who it was because they didn't uh, change the email address. You know what I'm saying? So I was able to get back in and delete all that. But I wanted y'all to know that I'm alive and I'm well. And I love y'all. Thank y'all for thinking about me. And I'm going to be around here for a long time. Mm -hmm. Me and Lip Chat. So I just wanted to say that. You know, and I love y'all, and thank y'all so much for even caring about me like that. Cause it make me bring tears almost to my eyes. But um, yeah, I'm alive. I'm alive, and I'm well, and I'm gonna be alive and well for a long time with the help of God. So I just wanted to say that. So now y'all can go on. Y'all can 
be drunk for this holiday weekend and all those good things, okay? But yeah, I'm here. Man, I don't even be on my phone like that. I swear to God, a breeze wouldn't have popped out the door. I wouldn't even know I was supposed to be. That's crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. But it do show me one thing, though. What it did show me, and this is ironic. What it did show me is, like I said, how many people that do care. Because when I tell you my phone started going crazy, crazy, I have, like, right now, like, six or seven hundred texts right now that I got to return. I had people popping up at my door, you know. So, the love is real, and I feel it, and I'm happy that you guys was giving it to me. And that's all I wanted to say. And for the motherfuckers who's writing down there, I would fake that Y'all can eat a a big fat, well, no, you might like You can eat a motherfucking monkey How about that? Because it would never do no shit like that. I ain't the one. I don't pull stunts. I don't do drama. I don't do dramatic. That's not me. I've been around here for a long time. I don't do dramatic. Unless it's time. Oh, somebody else at my door right now. Let's see who this is. Come to check and see if I'm. Thanks for tuning in to NIMAG TV.